Hi guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to uh, set a cron tab to execute every 5 minutes in a Linux machine. Cron daemon is a built-in Linux utility that runs processes on your system at a scheduled time. So cron basically reads the cron uh, tables for free defined commands and scripts. So in this uh, demo I will show you how to take uh, the complete slash var slash log folder as a backup and uh, save it into a destination folder slash var slash backup for every 5 minutes. The first step when you log into the Linux machine, uh, make sure you have the root user access, give uh, su space iPhone, enter the root user password and uh, make sure the cron tab is running, uh, you just simply give cron tab space minus l and uh, you, you will get this output. Also uh, go to the uh, the folder which uh, we are going to take as a backup slash by slash log and also go to the destination folder and uh, make sure any files are there uh, before we put the uh, the backup files. Right now you can see it is showing a total zero. Then uh, we can go into the cron tab space minus e that will take you to the cron tab editor where we actually enter the cron tab commands. The syntax is uh, like, it will be like this, um, the first asterisk you can see it uh, represents the minute, the second one is hour, day of the month, month number and day of the week starting uh, from Sunday at zero. So the command uh, which you are going to execute is this one, sudo tar and then slash where slash backup slash uh, the file name where we are putting all the backup uh, data and uh, the source file folder is here slash var slash log asterisk log so any file that is ending with the log will be backed up and stored under uh, this new file name which we are giving here under slash var slash backup so to take the backup of uh, uh, these files uh, let's say for every five minutes um, there are two way uh, the first method is like this we can uh, give um, uh, you know, uh, 0, 5, 10, like incrementing 5 and for uh, hours, day, month and day of the week you can simply give asterisk followed by the actual Linux command to tar and then uh, save the backup of slash var slash log. The second option is to use a, a step op operator uh, which will take the uh, backup for every 5 minutes like uh, asterisk slash 5 and uh, for hours, day, month and day of the week we give asterisk then the actual command that's going to get executed every five minutes. So uh, once we are ready with this uh, command, we can go to cron tab space um, minus e. It will take you to the uh, the VM editor, and uh, then you press J. It will take you to the uh, editing mode. You can see the bottom of the page. You can see the insert option here and uh, we can type in the command um, so in this example I'm using the second option the one I showed here asterisk slash 5 then uh, day month and uh, so, uh, sorry hours day month and day of the week uh, giving asterisk followed by the actual command then you can uh, give colon w uh, q that will write cute and then uh, ex exit and uh, after that you can see uh, an option like this, uh, it's installing the new cron tab. And you can see um, at the moment it is showing total zero, but after five minutes, let's say 18.25, you will see a backup file getting uh, stored here. So at 18.25, we can see the file name, whatever we given in the uh, uh, command, uh, it is there. And every five minutes, uh, you can see the file size is incrementing. At 8.25, this is the file size, and 8.30, you can see the file size increasing. And 845, you can see the file size getting increasing. So every five minutes, it will uh, keep appending the data into this backup folder. And if you want to troubleshoot um, the cron uh, tab details, you can go to slash var slash log. There you have cron dot log. You can open it and you can see what's happening, uh, you know, in the cron logs. Uh, it will also show you the uh, the command that is getting executed every five minutes. You can see 825, 830. 835, 840, uh, the command that we have entered, uh, sudo tar slash var slash backup, the file name slash var slash log, asterisk log, that is getting executed every 5 minutes. This is my Linux machine. I'm giving su minus and then the root user password. I'm in the root user mode now. So 
so cd slash var slash log i have this many files so any files um, ending with long i will take a, as a backup and we also go to slash slash var slash backup so right now there is no files so here we will put all the backup files every 5 minutes now i enter into the uh, the cron editor with the command uh, cron tab space minus e so this is the vim editor you have to press a to enter into the editing mode you can see the prompt change to insert here and uh, the command uh, will type in here So the command needs to be executed every five minutes. So I given the step operator uh, asterisk slash five, and for um, uh, the hours, day, day of the week, uh, everything I given uh, as asterisk. So this is the actual command that I'm typing will be executed every five minutes. So this is the destination folder slash var slash uh, backup, and then the file the file name. I'll just give five minutes backup. So slash var slash log slash asterisk logs. So this is the command that will get executed uh, every five minutes now. sudo tor zcpf slash 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 backups the file name and the uh, the source folder where we are taking the backup so now press escape and uh, give colon w quit you can see the chrome tab installing new chrome tab now and when i give chrome tab space minus l you can see the crown tab listed here the one just i created now let's go to slash bar slash backups so right now there is no files at um, after five minutes uh, we will see a backup file getting generated here now uh, I'm under this slash bar slash uh, backups. I can see a new file uh, got generated here. So every five minutes, we'll see the file size will get incremented here. So the last backup happened at 18:40. So now let's see again. So you can see the time change here, 1845. So from 1840 to 1845, uh, we have five minutes gap and uh, you can see the file size increased. It. Uh, it has taken one more backup. Let's go to slash where slash log. You can see there is a cron.log file here. Let's open it. Here you can see at uh, 1840 there is one backup. And again 1845 the command uh, got executed and uh, it has taken the backup again here. I mean the same command uh, getting executed every 5 minutes. that's the procedure how you can uh, execute the chrome tab uh, to take any command output or execute any scripts uh, in a scheduled uh, time like every five minutes or every one hour thanks for watching the video have a nice time